What's good, YouTube? Welcome back to another video, man. And today, unfortunately, Kevin got hit by a car again, y'all. Y'all know he got hit by a car before. He was on his moped. He flew off, did a front flip. You know, I joked on him about it when I went to New York. And I was like, don't let it happen again. But, bro, it really happened again. At first, I didn't believe it. But the video just dropped. So let's just get straight into it, man. I'm going to react to it. I'm going to pause it a little bit sometimes, but I'm going to try to play it through mostly. If y'all haven't seen it, I'll link it in the description so y'all can go watch it on your own. But you feel me? I am going to be pausing it a little bit just so I can uh, talk about some things. My boy Intro Fire. Hold on. Hold Damn, hold on. He in the ambulance? That boy in the ambulance. He's not even in the stretcher. Hold on. Damn, hold on. They got that boy. It don't look like his scalp really got injured. I don't see no like cuts on his scalp, but bro, that do rag messed up. So he scraped his head, like his head. I want to hear how he explains this, because I know he scraped his head somehow, but dang y'all. Not my boy Durag. You can't mess up my boy. Hey, whoever hit you, Kev, I told you last time. Hey, last time Kev got hit by a car, I told him, you could have sued. Like, the girl gave him money that hit him and got his, his um, moped fixed and got him new AirPods. But, hey, this time, bro, they almost took your life. So, I'm not saying sue him for all they got, but, bro... You might have to take this to court, like, depending on who fault it was. You might got to get a bag, my boy. I don't know what the other injuries is, but just off that, bro, like, that's your head. That's your cranium, your dome, your skillet, bro. Let me turn that volume back up. Hold on. Oh, I don't think there's no audio for this clip. But dang, his wrist. Dang, they got his nipple out. Whoa, hold on. Was that boy sleep? Isn't it? Hold on. I'm sorry for pausing so much early, but hold on. Was he sleep right here? That boy eyes closed. Look at Kev. I got it right before it cut off. That boy off that pill. Was good shot. Yeah. Yesterday was crazy, bro. So just know it was me, all my friends, right? First of all, before I even say anything. My left hand, just know a vessel you got popped in my hand, and there was like a big bubble, and that was just for the blood or something like that. That's what the doctors told me. Bruh, Sue, I already see your head like they ripped your durag. You popped a vessel in your arm, Brody. Sue, hey, nah, you gotta get a bag off this. You almost lost your life. You gotta get a bag, like at least like 10 bands, bro. Something that's your life, man. Man, that hurts. And then we got my arm right here, man. Pain, and distress, soon for all that. Yeah. I, I can't show oh, yeah, I seen his shoulder in the picture right on Instagram. Yeah, I don't got a dirty shirt on. It's the shirt from yesterday, man, because I can't really change like that. You feel me? I just came from the hospital. I was there for, like, almost 10 hours. But, yeah, yesterday it was me and, like, you know, a couple of my friends. We all had, it was, like, three regular bikes, my moped, you know, my dirt bike. My friend was riding my dirt bike. And basically, we was riding around all day, right? We was riding around all day, just chilling and stuff like that. And then as soon as my moped was dying, like, it was on one bar. If y'all know what that is, like a little school school or whatever, it's electric. It's my little electric bike or whatever. And it was on one bar, so it was about to die. It was literally blinking red, saying that it's about to die. So I'm like, all right, let's go bring it back to the house. So mind you, it's not even going fast because, you know, it's dying. So as soon as I go across the street, it's a red light too, y'all. Yeah? Red light. Some guy and his friends, you know, because they were racing and stuff like that, just passing red lights and all of that. So as I was crossing on my moped, you know, trying to bring it to the house to put it to charge, a car just came. Boom! He was going fast. I know he was going at least, at least, I don't know, I can't remember. All I heard was my friend say, Cav, I had no time to move or none of that. So as soon as he hit me, bro, I, was on top, I went on top of the hood, right, on top of the car. And then he braked. Obviously, you know, you're gonna brake if you hit something. He braked, so I flew off of the car. So basically, I feel like if he didn't brake or he braked slowly, I think I would've been good. But just know my arm, bro, my arm is all scraped up. I can't even show you that. And then... I know I said, bro, hold on. Bro said, he said they was racing and then they hit him and he, so it's definitely the dude fault. Bro, hit you. It was a red light. You definitely got to get that bag, bro, because he almost ended your life. 
but nah, he hit he hit him, got on top of the hood, slammed the brake, flew off. Bro, this is the second time he been hit. Like, Kev a warrior, bro. Kev, he, bro, he taking hits. He surviving. That's crazy. He not just getting shot with BB guns. Kev got shot before. He got hit by two cars, not one, but two cars. Yeah. Pop the vessels. Should I take it off? I don't think I can take it off. Well, I can, but I don't know if the doctor wants me to take it off. But, hey, all I gotta say is, glad to be alive, and I can't wait till my hand fix so I can go ride again on my dirt bike, because I just fixed my dirt bike. But I didn't get hit off my dirt bike yet. I got hit off the moped that was dying, because I was trying to bring it to the house to put on the charger. But I just want to go ride my dirt bike. I just got it fixed yesterday, and then, and then I got hit yesterday. Like, come on now, I didn't even get to ride it for a day. Oh, yeah, and I do have blood on my head but i can't show you that you know youtube is probably gonna take it up take it down but yeah yeah be right there you ever see my do right yeah yeah i know it's crazy i bought a helmet too but the day i decide not to wear it is the day i got hit Damn. hey i'm glad he said that he said he's glad that he's still alive like in times like this when something really unfortunate happens you can either have a good mindset or you can have a bad mindset like why this happened to me Oh my gosh, this is like the worst moment ever and be all sad about it. Or you could be like, bro, I'm so glad I made it out alive. It could have been way worse and you just move on. But I feel him though. He just got his dirt bike fixed the day before and then boom, doesn't get to ride. But when you get hurt in times like this and you know, your hand messed up, your head hurt, you feel me, your shoulder, like it makes you realize how grateful you need to be when you're healthy. Like. When nothing's wrong with you, when you're feeling good, when you don't have any cuts on your shoulder, your head, you're not sick, like, don't take those days for granted, like, you feel me? Every day is a blessing, truly, like, when you get sick, you be like, dang, I just wish I would feel better, like, and then when you feel better again, you just forget how easily it is, like, you could be sick again, and then, so when you healthy, everybody watching this video, I hope y'all healthy, you feel me? Nothing wrong with y'all, don't take life for granted, don't take your health for granted, man. Let me show you my, my do-rag, man. Uh, bro, this hand hurts. I can't do nothing with it. Dang, bro. Look at that, man. Scrape my head on the ground, man. But I ain't gonna lie. Thank God I didn't hit my head hard because I didn't I didn't really know that I was bleeding on my head until my friend pointed it out. So it was probably just a scrape, you feel me? I didn't really hit it too hard. But yeah, if this Don't want to mess up those dreads. Like you feel me? Can't mess up his dreads. My boy trying to grow his dreads out. And they trying to knock his dreads off on the street. But I know his sister like thought he was pranking her. Like, yo, I just got hit by a car. Can't stop playing with me. No, like, I just got hit by a car again. Like, bro, come on. My shoulder didn't get scraped up. And I didn't hit my head. I, I would have been probably good. Just like, just if it was the arm. But no, actually, I wish I never... I think the car hit this hand. I don't know, but I wish this arm never got hurt. If it didn't, I would have been good because this is just like, you know, scrapes and stuff like that. It's big cuts. You know, it was it was dropping blood. But, you know, if it was just that, you know, it would have been good after today, you know, just, well, like two days, you know, just cleaning up and stuff like that. But this probably would take a little while, yeah. I don't know, I don't know how long it takes for is the vessel to, like, grow back or something. I don't know, man. Just know that was crazy, man. Appreciate everybody that checked up on me on my Instagram, man. Appreciate y'all boys, man. My DMs was going crazy, bro. Everybody was DMing me. You good, you good, you good. I'm sorry to leave y'all, you know, stranded. And I text y'all back, but I was in the hospital all day, you feel me? But yeah, yeah, that's basically it. And yeah, it happened yesterday. So I don't know if I'm going to be doing too much videos. I do got a couple packages coming in that I got to unbox. But I don't know how that's going to work. I only got one hand. Barely got this hand, but... <laughs> I can't really, bro, like if I move my fingers, okay, it's not hurting as much. Okay, it's, it's feeling better. Yesterday I cannot move my fingers, like if I move this, it's gonna hurt. I think this would be good, cause it's not a broken arm, man. I thought it was broke, cause it was a- I'm glad it's not broke, man. Sheesh, things like this just make you realize, like, everything that you think so important, like, you feel me? He's trying to upload every day for y'all, trying to make the best content for y'all. He's already talking about unboxing videos with one hand, like he's like, Yo, how am I gonna unbox this gun with one hand? He already trying to put his health second to y'all, put y'all first, so you feel me? None of that really matters because
he could have lost his life. And then none of this would even be relevant. Like his YouTube channel, like everything would just be gone. Like, you feel me? Something would have happened and it was more serious than all this YouTube stuff. Everything else going on just doesn't matter. So the fact that he did make it out and he's already trying to get back to YouTube, you feel me? Salute to Kev, man. He a soldier, but I'm glad to see that he good. I hope his hand heals fast, head, shoulder. You feel me? We already did our first collab video, so if you didn't see my collab videos with Kev, make sure you go check them out. Hey, one of our YouTube shorts, I'm gonna try to put it right here. Nah. Hey, yo, sussy baka. Kev moaned at the end when I shot him with the full auto, and some Instagrams reposted, like a meme page with like 500k followers, another meme page. Um, we got reposted on YouTube and stuff, but you feel me? They was not tagging us. They ain't getting our credit, man. It's only got a million views. Like, me and Kev ready to go crazy. We gonna take over. Watch. In the next three years, watch how me and Kev grow crazy on YouTube. We just getting started, man. So, I'm glad to see that he's straight. Kev, if you watching this, bro, be easy, my boy. I mean that. When I left New York, I was like, alright, bro. We dapped all. I was like, bro, be easy out here. Like, Every night when he would leave my hotel room after we make some videos, I'll walk him out and I'll watch him drive away. I tell him, be careful, be easy out here, don't get hit again, like joking around. Like, I'm like, don't get hit. I think I even put it in one of my videos. Like, I'll try to find it, put the clip in. Dropping bangers every day, so check out his channel. Make sure you turn on notifications on both sides. Stay tuned, man. I don't got nothing else to say. I'm gonna catch y'all later, man. Yup. Yeah. YouTube action. Drive safe, Kevin. Don't get hit again. All right, my boy. Yes, sir, and he gone. I was like, bro, don't get hit again. Damn, Kev, you just gotta get hit again. But that's not your fault, I understand, but. Hey, man, be safe out here. Y'all watching this too, not just Kev. Everybody out here, be safe, bro. I'm gonna catch y'all on my next video, man. Warning. All stunts performed in this video were conducted by trained professionals in a safe, controlled environment. Super safe. Do not try this at home.